Are you ready for an adventure? Are you ready to go? She's like, come on, let's get this rig rolling. Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, Pontius. Apparently, it's it's this it's this type of day. <laughs> Hun, I think the dogs are a little bit stir crazy. They're like, oh my goodness, it's so crazy! You're gonna spill the coffee out again. Kira says, I need my caffeine, please, so I can be ready to go on an adventure. Don't worry, guys. The lid is on the coffee. She's not getting any. She just really likes to think she's drinking Dad's coffee. Would you like to try? See, there's nothing there. There's nothing there. It's just the lid. They just, they, they smell it, and they're yeah. like, we can get the coffee! Yeah. Whoa. Memphis did that yesterday, yeah. and I thought she was going down. I'm like, oh, no! Yeah, Dad, give me my coffee. I need my coffee so I can... <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're caffeinated up there, dear. Right. All right, so we're getting ready to load up the dogs and take off on an adventure. And it's beautiful outside. Sunny, nice, warm, which is good, considering we're not going to have any heat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why don't we have heat? We don't have any propane. I mean, we have heat. We have heat. We snuggle the dogs. We just don't have easy, accessible heat. Yeah, yeah. Because the vehicle has gas and the vehicle heats up and has a motor. That is true. Up. I didn't think about that. But I don't think the people in the tent really want our Yeah, those people. Motor they, running. Which, by the way, they have a really cool tent set up. But yeah, I don't think they want our motor running. No. We're just going to pick up a ceramic heater since we forgot ours. Yeah, I was gonna say, we have one. But, but then we'll have one specifically for the RV. Yeah. And we won't ever take out of here and it'll be perfect. What do you think? Eleanor had a sneezy fit this morning, but her nose is looking better, so maybe it'll be better before we even get home. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows with the nose? All right, let's get ready. Are you ready for an adventure? Are you ready to go? She's like, come on, let's get this rig rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. All right, everybody's loaded up and ready. We're going on an adventure. Look at the lake today, you guys. You don't normally see superior like glass, but today it kind of looks like glass. Hi, you ready? Yeah, you ready? She's like, yeah, I think I'm ready. Let's go. Memphis is in there too. She right there. Let's go. Hi. Are you sticking your head out? All right, you girls hang out for a minute. We're going to get you out in a minute. Jamie's going to sit with you. We came here a couple years ago to the old, one of the old uh, mines. He's going to show us some cool stuff. They got all kinds of people now showing us cool stuff. This We took some pictures of the inside of this building a couple years ago, but this is kind of neat. Uh, the mines further north tend to have big pieces of copper. Okay, um, this they tend, uh, this mine tended to have amygdaloid, which is... So I believe this is Champion Mine is the name of this place. It is so cool. We're gonna go walk down and around a little bit. They're inside getting a little mini tour right now. I came to hang out with the dogs for a second so Jamie could go check some stuff out. They've been doing so much work here since the last time we came here. They're actually, they're doing like tours and they're doing all these different things and they've made the building stable enough so that you can actually pay for a tour to go up into this big shaft. This is a big mine shaft, so that's kind of cool. What do you think? I had to go let dad go in and see the cool stuff. Yeah, I had to let him go see all the cool stuff. We're just gonna hang out here for a minute. I know, we'll hang out here for a minute. What do you think? Like we're ready for adventure. Check it out. What year did this shaft close down? 1967. Okay, so it's closing down. Now, I have to qualify that because this didn't stop operating at that point. Okay, this shaft continued to operate and continued to ah, cool. the mine. So that really nice man in there that was giving the tour was just telling us that when they shut down the mines, they still use this place to get fresh water to a lot of these communities because they found potable groundwater down in the bottom of the shaft. So they found drinkable water and they still to this day use a lot of the drinkable water in like the communities here, which I had no idea. The mining company actually gave this over to the county so they could still use it to get fresh water. No idea, learn something new today. So this is the captain's office, the mine captain's office. And he said we could go in here and check it out. And he said all of these are copies of historical documents from the mine. That's kind of cool. Look. This is all ore from this mine, Mom. That's kind of cool. Champion number four shaft house. That's where we are. So he said, this is the type of copper that you get out of this mine, which I guess he said was slightly different. How cool. The blueprints of the mine. That's kind of neat. Oh, look at 
look at there's a little model and everything. That's a cool little sink tub thing. A little model. Warning, models are not attached to base. Move with care. Very cool. There's a bunch of people worked in the mine. Very cool. They're out there picking rocks. They're looking for copper and stuff. And I am hanging out with the girls. Hi, girls. I don't want to get them out here because there's like lots of like bolts and glass and stuff on the ground here. So we're hanging out here and Indy's in the truck behind me and I'm keeping an eye on everybody. And thankfully it's nice and cool out today so we're not overheating in here. Kira's like, let's go. We made it back to the Porkies and holy cow, Superior looks beautiful. It looks superior today. Yeah, definitely a big bay we're in. But... Yeah, it's beautiful. But that is Porcupine Mountains without the fog right. <laughs> and the clouds. And we're going back to Lake the Clouds. And they're all down there rock picking. All of them. Yeah, that guy's got a bucket. He's going for it. He's looking for agates. Yeah. Maybe we'll stop on the way back Yeah, now. we probably will. Oh, there's a dog in the water. Yeah. Uh, I thought that said Unknown River. So anyway, we're going back to the Porkies. It's absolutely beautiful today. But do we want to go to the visitor center? No, we don't need to go to the visitor center. We know what's there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hon. I feel like we were just here. I feel like we were just here too. But look, we can see through the woods. <laughs> right? When we were here, what, two days ago, we couldn't even see the parking lot from here. The dogs are like, yes, let's do it. Let's do it. You want to go see Lake of the Clouds? Only actually see it this time without clouds. Let's go. I know, it's so exciting. Super <laughs> exciting. It's like, yeah, I'm super excited. And then there's a dog. Oh my goodness, here we go. You ready? You're gonna see it. Oh, look, a dog. <laughs> That's like, this a dog. Hi, dog. <laughs> you see? What do you think? You made it again. Hi, pupper dog. All the dogs. <laughs> Yeah. Is that your new best friend? Eleanor's like, this is my new best friend. <gasps> Look, there's a lake over there. Now you can see. I wonder if there's any fish in that lake. Kira's like, whoa, there's a lake over there? Whoa, what's down there, huh? What's down there, Kira? She's like, wait, I've been here before. This is someplace I have been before. Look, Jamie's got all three dogs. You're managing them. They're doing good. We gotta go find mom and dad. They're probably over there. So we'll go. Yeah, I don't know if anybody else will. We'll go walk that way and see what we can see. Yeah, Memphis is like, yeah, oh, Memphis knows I have pocket snacks. <laughs> She's like, right here, right here. Right here. Like, Mom has pocket snacks. <laughs> These woods here are always so cool looking. The dogs are taking in every smell they can. Every smell you can. Apparently, if you walk that way, there's a cliff. Mm -hmm. I bet a good lookout. Do you want to try it? I mean, might as well. Let's try it. see your folks on this side yet. They're over there somewhere. They got to make it up that hill. We came up the steep hill. All right, let's go. Memphis is like, I'm going to walk off the path. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything smells amazing. Oh, no, this is downhill there. Oh. It looks like you could sneak up over there, but I don't think they want you to. I don't want to go downhill. Yeah, I don't want to go downhill. Thanks, either. but no thanks. <laughs> Back down the path. We got left behind. Okay, we didn't really get left behind. But Eleanor is like, my sisters are ahead of me. I, yeah, I know you, you see them. You see them. There's the lake over that way. Eleanor is like, I want to be the lead dog. Let me get in the front. She's like, hi, Dad. Hi. She's like, I couldn't see you, and I didn't know where you were. <laughs> All right, let's go. She's like, okay, look at you girls. <laughs> Like, now, and that's a new friend. Yeah, you got to see Lake of the Clouds. Yeah, and we could actually see. We could, <laughs> yeah. Much nicer day today. I mean, it was a nice day when we were here, even with the fog. It wasn't cold. Yeah, this is, this it was not true. cold. But uh, if the sun were to come out, I know you want to go out. Oh, She's like, car. let's go <laughs> parkour. But yeah, if the sun comes out, it, it'll get a little warm. Yeah, it was out when we were standing on top of the hill. And I'm like, ah, uh, yeah, I should take my hoodie off. <laughs> yeah, I noticed. I'm like, I'm getting kind of warm. Yep. And then it, it went cloudy again. So. Yep. What do you think, girls? <laughs> yeah, these trees are all starting to change, hon. Uh, getting close. It's yeah. happening. Won't be long. We'll be raking leaves. I'm ready for that crisp, cool air. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, my Bonfires. goodness. Yes. I mean, we had one of those last night. We'll mm -hmm. probably have one again tonight. Mm -hmm. But yes. What? Do you see everybody eating lunch and you're like, how come I'm not eating lunch? Is that what you're thinking? Well, they're having lunch. How come I'm not having lunch? You had a cheese stick and bread and a bunch of other meats. So I think you're fine. <laughs> She's like, I'm mad. So we're still at Lake of the Clouds. We're just having, we're having a little picnic lunch over here and then we're gonna head up the road. I think we'll go to some waterfalls next. I'm pretty sure that's the plan. We made it to the Porcupine Mountains. Where do we park? We park up here, keep going. Further up is the bridge? Yeah. Not back yeah. here. Okay. Right there at that picnic table, a very historic event happened right there. Yeah. You know what it was? It was, the historic event was this dog right here eating Dan's sandwich. Ripped it right out of his hand. <laughs> Uh, a memory we talk about many times because it was pretty funny. I warned him. I said, she'll steal that right out of your hand. And then you did because you're so cute. <gasps> Ready? Into the thick of it. Woo! <laughs> she, she like stops and turns. Mm -hmm. Look at these big giant trees. They're huge. I smell oh it. my goodness. So we're going to uh, Jamie's favorite waterfall. Mm -hmm. Come on. I know everything smells amazing. We understand. I think I have a couple of pictures of the dog standing on some big logs right back in here. I, that's what I was just thinking too. Is I it thought here so. Or is it I don't remember. Cast I falls? don't remember. <laughs> we have too many photos there. from everywhere. Yep. Uh, I mean, I guess there's no such thing as too many photos. <laughs> but you know, I know we have some photos of us well, from a long time ago standing in front of the front of one of these trees I think here. This one in front of us that broke. Could be. Yeah, because that was a big tree. Yeah. Oh man, it smells amazing. It smells so good. We just gotta sniff all the things. This area is closed. Yeah, don't walk that way. Okay. Yeah, they don't want you to take a shortcut. I hear your waterfall already. Oh, the good. temperature dropped too. I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, it got a little chilly. I think, is this the tree that I had the big... Been, I, don't I don't know. That was a big tree. Woo! Going There's a root. <laughs> <laughs> Can she do it? I'm sorry, Kira. Here's I... the bridge. There's Jamie's this. favorite waterfall. Can she do you it? got this. Can she do it? She won't even know, right? She won't realize it until it starts moving. Look at her, she's doing it! Oh, Good there's the radar girl. ears. Good girl. Okay, I'm stopping. Yeah, we gotta take photos. Look. There it is, and look, Jamie! Like, no. It doesn't have uh, too much water! Perfect. Oh, I gotta get a bunch of photos. Yeah, it looks like my background <laughs> on my phone. It does. <laughs> Only I'll have it in better quality. And then we'll go down there and get some pictures of the dogs like we did before. Yeah. How cool. So if you guys don't know, this is Unnamed Falls in the Porcupine Mountain State Park. On the and Presque Hill River. On the Presque Hill River. And this is the last section of the waterfall before it goes out into Superior, which you can see right over there. And this is Jamie's favorite waterfall. And Jamie doesn't have a lot of favorites of anything. Yeah. Can <laughs> but, you see why though? I but mean, this is Jamie's favorite waterfall. Cool. It is a very cool waterfall. And sometimes it doesn't look like this. Sometimes you can't barely tell that it has all those cool swirls in it because it uh, it flows too much. Oh, my dog's still honking. She's still honking, hun. She's like, I just wanna go super fast. I just wanna go super fast. You're ruining the nature for everybody. What's wrong with you? My mom's gonna walk over all this? Okay, I guess. She says she can. She made the steps. What are you looking for? I know. What are you looking for? You're dancing. All right, be careful. Take it slow. I'm putting the camera down because I don't want to fall either. And toes in superior. Too good, huh? It's like, oh yeah, this is amazing and I love it. Now I'd just like to go swimming, please. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're finding agates. Is that what we're doing? Yeah, should be here. It should be. Memphis is like, this is amazing. I got to come to the lake. I do love the lake. Is that good stuff, Memphis? Look at all the rocks, everybody. So many rocks. I'm coming this way with you. Yeah. I'm gonna see if I can. Probably can't see up the river here, huh? Yeah. Uh, see up the river? No, kind of. No. We can, bit, no. we can pretend. 
Are you going for it? I'm in the water. It ended the row, girls. Look at that, you made it. My husband's just like, there's a seagull out there, Dad. So there's the river that that waterfall is on. More mountains, more mountains, and the water. I just picked this up. This is an agate. Hey, hon. Yes. You want to see what I found? Sure. Here you go. Here you go. What? <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't focus on that. That's They're really little. My lord. It's a whole rock full of agates. What? No way. Yeah. No way. <laughs> this, that is so weird. Can you guys see that? It's a, it's a bunch of agates. There's like four yeah. or five agates all in one agate. Yeah, I just found that. That is so, there's got to be a name for that. Mine. Mine. <laughs> That's the best rock right it's there. It's mine. That rock? And you just found that yeah, right Yeah, I was just right here. I just looked down and it was there. I'm telling you. You can. I just know how to do it. That's all. Yeah, you do. I'm just good you, at it. All right, you got to do that again. Okay, I'll, I'll try. <laughs> That's nice. Eleanor, can I see, what are you going to do with it? You took it from Kira and now you don't know what to do with it. Where, do, where are you going to put it? Are you going to bury it? Are you going to chew on it? Chew on it. I thought you were going to bury it. You were making me laugh. That was Kira's. She found that fair and square. Eleanor's like, I don't care. I took it from her and now it's mine. Kira's like, Dad, I need a new stick. Right. She took on my stick. We're hiking through the woods, so we're leaving the beach and we're going to get some fun yes. photos of the dogs. Memphis is like, I gotta walk way over here. This is the spot to walk. She wants to walk right there. Okay, so we just did a really cute photo shoot with the dogs. Now Jamie's got all three. Make sure they're not eating nothing. <laughs> and now, uh, so this is Jamie's favorite waterfall, but he told me to come over here and get some footage of it. So I'm gonna come over here and not fall because that's deep water. We're gonna get closer, closer to the waterfall. I'm gonna put you down. So there's a more up close look at Jamie's favorite waterfall. That's so cool. So crazy. You can see all the swirls over there. Very cool. Look at that. And if you got poop or something, just tell me. <laughs> I got these two. Jamie's carrying the other one. And we're heading back. We're loaded up, headed back. We got a long drive back. And we're back in the RV. So I want to point out, we did run out of propane last night, which I said, but we ran to Walmart in Houghton and we got a heater, which is better than nothing because it was, let me check my thing here. It was 60 degrees inside the rig when we got back and now it's 64.5 and we've had it running for a few minutes. So this is gonna be enough to get this space nice and warm. Now, normally we have one of these that stays under the seat, but we took it out last winter because we use it in the house. So this is now the RV heater. It will stay in here so that if we ever run out of propane, we'll always have this as a solution if we need it. Like I said, we have one, we just uh, took it out. I just fed the girls their dinner super late. They had, what did you guys have? You had snacks, you had a sandwich, you had an apple, you had a bite of a pear. You actually ate a lot of stuff, didn't you? Oh, you had a cheese stick that you shared. So they definitely were not starving, but I forgot to grab their lunch slash dinner when we left. So they're eating really late, but I think they'll be fine. Are you, Are you cooking? I thought you were gonna put something in my mouth. <laughs> you camera. want me to put the camera in your mouth? No. I'm like, what are you feeding me? Yeah, a camera. I'm thirsty. What are you nibbling on? No. A pickle. Pickle. Uh, Look at, we're making mm -hmm. burgers and Jamie's grilling mushrooms and onions. This is like the traditional camping dinner anymore, huh? It's smelling great. I feel like we use this almost as much as we cook on the fire. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we do both. We do. We definitely do. So I didn't film the rest of dinner, but we did have burgers for dinner. And now, listen. It sounds worse than it is. It's very lightly sprinkling rain. So the boys are all gonna go. So my dad, Jamie, and my cousin Bobby, they're all gonna go down and look for some rocks. And we are gonna chill out here with the nice heat because we have a heater. Actually, I think I'm gonna walk the dogs real quick before it starts raining any harder. And then, and then we're gonna chill out right here in the RV. So you made it back. 
and, the heater. Yeah, and now it's not raining, and you're going again. Good luck. Yeah, the last site we went to was all big yeah. rocks. Yeah. We determined that mo it is there. Right. But it's probably inside. Right, right. So we'll we'll show you later. But as you can see, see this white strip oh, right yeah. here? Yeah. That that white strip all glows orange. Yeah. You probably can't see because the lights are on. Well, a little bit, yeah. I got a couple of those yesterday when I was out there that were like red glowing things. Yeah, so that's that's about what the rock is out where we just look. So well, it I'm, quit raining and it's not midnight yet, so you go look and uh Yeah. They're gonna sleep. <laughs> They're all out. We're all out, out. Oh, Those. she opened her eyes. I'm gonna wash some dishes and get prepared because we gotta leave super early in the morning tomorrow. Because yeah. Miss Eleanor's going to the vet tomorrow to see if we can figure out her snot nose issue. Yeah, yeah you have a snot nose. All right, go. Good luck. Yeah. I'm gonna wash some dishes. You're back. I am. And you found a couple. Only a couple. Eh, still better than nothing. And the rain stopped. And the rain did quit. So. I think that's the two best sides right there. Yeah, those are definitely cool. Very cool. And the other one, I don't know, has some in it, but probably yeah. some on the other side. Fancy. Cool. We got so, our heater going. I know. It's definitely warm. Look at bowls so bowl. of rocks. Here, that looks better probably in there. As I said, don't move them around. It's like nails on a chalkboard. I know. We shouldn't be using these bowls, but it works. So they're in there. Yep. <sighs> All right, so we have to get up really... Oh, here's your other ones. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's more in there. Yeah, it's probably better than the bowl option. <laughs> yeah, it's a little smart. That's funny, uh, this one back there is half. Uh, it's only half. Geez. You can't see it. Uh, so we yeah. are heading to bed. We are heading home tomorrow, hopefully getting Eleanor into the vet to figure out what's going on with her nose. And hopefully getting the A-OK -okay to continue on to our next trip to Pennsylvania. Yeah. <laughs> Which I think will be fine think, for I that. We'll see. I think it'll be all good, but we'll find out. So we are going to go ahead and call it a night. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. And we will see you again soon. Say goodnight, partyers. For any of those that we're going to that we're gonna say, where's Kira? And you can't see it because it's dark, but her tongue is sticking out. Can you see it? She's got a little black. She's like, guys, I had an amazing day today. Good night, audience.